The Honourable Member for Lindsay. Steve. Steve had a magic wand and supposed to make broadband services the envy of the world at a very reasonable price. The Western Weekender editor, Troy Dodds, who is here today, tells a very different story about his experience with the NBN. In fact, he was so frustrated with the process, he claims to now be starting a crusade to return to dial-up internet. Drastic, perhaps, but an indication of the people's, in people's anger with the previous government's smoke and mirrors policy. Apparently, Penrith is NBN ready. Troy arrived home run one day to find a grey box outside his house. The only thing missing was a gift tag from Kevin and Julia. His words, not mine. He goes on to say, after checking his current broadband provider, Optus, it was revealed that the charge for switching to NBN was only $10 a month. Two appointments were set, one for NBN Tech to work his magic and the other for Optus to be installed, to install the modem. For Troy, the first sign of the NBN is a clunky, difficult piece of infrastructure, was two rather intrusive boxes installed in front of his house. He then hit a further technical snag where he could not do more and the clunky boxes to connect to the NBN, resulting in further delays. This just goes to show that the Labor Party's policy of NBN has continued to fail the peaceful Western Sydney.